Good evening. Police are hopeful a florist may help them track down a callous home invasion gang. The three men burst into a Minchinbury home after pretending to have a flower delivery of yellow daisies. The gang made off with cash and jewellery worth $50,000. Sydney's prestige event, the Golden Slipper, was run under a cloud as officials pursued allegations of race fixing. At least 10 jockeys are under investigation. Meantime, Jim Cassidy has copped a six-month riding ban for refusing to attend the inquiry. Former Premier Nick Greiner has announced his separation from his wife Catherine. No reasons for the split have been given, although a spokesman for the couple says a devastated Mrs Greiner intends to continue her campaign to become Sydney's Lord Mayor. Self-confessed wife basher Noel Crichton-Brown is to quit politics at the next federal election. The Liberal Senator's decision follows intense pressure from within the party and represents a big win for John Howard. Do other than acknowledge that he's made uh uh, a great sacrifice in the interests of the Liberal Party would be mean-spirited and churlish. The RSPCA has issued a warning to pet owners after a spate of horrific mutilations on Sydney cats. In the past eight months, three cats have been left for dead after shocking knife attacks. Vets advise owners to keep their pets indoors overnight. Sydney's Royal Easter Show organisers are anticipating their best year yet. Crowds broke first day attendances yesterday with more than 70,000 packing into the showgrounds by dusk today. And Sydney's weather, dry with lengthy sunny periods and expected high tomorrow of 21 degrees.